they're completely dead inside. Let's have a look at the charger. As you can see, it's turning on and off and charging in pulses. The problem is, we thought it was the charger, so we replaced the charger with another charger. It still does that thing. Then we thought, oh, it must be the BMS. Then we replaced the BMS, but it's still acting like a little bitch and won't charge fully. So we did everything we could to fix this, and there is just one thing left, uh, a very rare case, a case you need someone like House MD to solve, a case with uh, ghost cells. So let's see if we have ghost cells here. 414, totally fine. 4.5, that's the problem. And why does it go up 400 millivolts in just a second? Is this some high charge type of cell? No, that means all the cells in this group have ghost voltage, meaning uh, they have less than 1000 milliampere hours. They might even have less than 100 milliampere hours. That's why it charges up to 4.5 so fast. I think I'm gonna capacity test this cell group. Yeah, let's do that and see if we find out anything more. 4.14, 10, under 4 volt, 3.8. It's like testing a button cell. Voltage. But here it actually seems to stop. Sometimes this ghost cell can have um, capacity in just some voltage ranges. Uh, having problems having zero capacity at anything over a specific voltage. But I think this battery is as good as dead. As you can see we have 20. We had like less than 10 milliampere hours from the voltage 3.8 to 4.2. So something is definitely wrong with this whole cell group, not just one cell. Yeah, you guessed it, cells worse than Chinese cells from the same company that is going around Europe suing everybody that's uh, selling their cells. LG and of course the genuine M26 lilac version, the worst cells on the planet. They're completely dead inside after less than three years. And this is not from some backdoor Chinese battery pack manufacturer. No, these are from giant corporations. LG, you are dead. You are dead in this game.